Good morning, mountain bikers. I'm Chris Wessels, and you're watching MTB Trail Review. Today, we're out at La Costa. It's been about three years since I've been out here. Got a fun little crew today. Uh, we're gonna try to hit all the main downhills. As I just said, it's been three years, so I'm not gonna be able to tell you if there's any changes because it's gonna be like riding blind again. But if you ride out here regularly, you can check it out for yourself, see what the conditions are like, and hopefully get a ride in. Let's go ride. That's the plan for now. Don't go down, right? <laughs> Yep, there it is. All right. So this is whip tail. We started out on Horn Lizard. And I think I know where we are now. Guys, I know I say this in most of my videos, but you don't have trail forks to get it. Without it, I'd be lost all the time. It's worth every penny. Ooh, that's muddy. Mud! Yeah, this is what we probably should have started with. <laughs> but that trail was much harder than I remember it, so my bad. <laughs> yeah. Whoop. I think I just went off trail right there. This one's definitely not as chunky. It's drop down. And we made the mistake of starting with drop down. I remember that trail being easier. I mean, that's a hard trail. So if you come out here and you're planning to ride drop down, do the smart thing and get yourself a warm up trail on one of these. So it does have some pedal sections in the middle. It's also got some nice burns. So it almost has like a black widow feel to it. Not quite as chunky. Climb. All right, we are continuing down with tail. Whoop. 
Oh, wrong gear. Tried to pedal when I was still in the climbing gear. Trail definitely has some pedal sections, but I don't even think we're halfway down yet. And we've gotten lots of really fun downhill sections too. So far, I think this trail's worth doing. It's worth the climb. Today. Oh well. You guys can make fun of me in the comments if you like. Pause here for a second. So we are getting into drop down. We kind of pre-wrote it earlier so I could try to remember some of the lines. I may end up walking a couple sections just because I don't remember all the lines. We'll see what happens. Oh, it wasn't pretty, but I made it. <laughs> My bad. Um, the shell is extremely chunky, very steep in sections, and uh, yeah, if you've never done it, give it a slow roll first. I think this trail is underrated. On trail forks, it is a black. I would call this a double black because of some of the sections you have. Um, very chunky, steep, tight turns. So, take it as you will. That's just what I think. Oh, that was way better than last time we went down. Fun little rock lift. There's all kinds of fun little trophies just to the side too, which is cool. I can appreciate that. And overall, the trail is also in very good condition. Uh, there is one spot where you have a split option. I think we're coming up to it soon. Uh, that probably rolls. This one definitely rolls. But anyway, there's lots of splits. Um, a lot of them roll, some of them do not. So definitely look before you leap. And there's one section that splits, it's super gnarly. 
one roll. This one rolls. Little jump right here. It is a tabletop. Looks a pretty lippy one. Yeah, not even close. Okay. This is the point I was talking about earlier. If you want to go to the right, unless you want to try the pro line, and I'll stop and show you what that means. And it does have a pro line rating on tailboards. Stop right here so I can show you. Unless you want to try this. Lobsters, that's what makes it fun. There is a double at the end of this trail. There are looking up to five times already today. And I'm just not having a very good jumping day today. So I'm gonna leave that. It's not that I'm having a bad jumping day, I'm having a bad jumping mindset day. I don't know why. And then there's a couple other doubles down the trail that you saw earlier. I won't be hitting those today either. I don't know if that rolls. I was thinking about it. Woo! -hoo. That was close. My brakes are getting a workout. Whew. Pause right here. There's some people hiking up. Don't want to scare the pants off of them. All right, there's a couple doubles on this trail too. Just haven't been feeling it today. Good morning. Thank you, just two more. All right, so now you have options. If you take a right, it'll take you back to switchbacks and climb back up. We're gonna head back to the truck, see how our buddy's doing, and maybe we'll get one more ride in. So we're, we're looking for signs for horned lizard. All right, so we are about to drop into a horned lizard. This is going to start the same as with tail, and then go to a different direction after that. And hopefully I'm taking us the right way. We'll find out in a minute. Yep, this is it. Okay, we're good. So, if I remember correctly, the trail is going to be pretty similar to Whiptail. I think it goes pointed down a little bit more. I don't think it has any or as many pedally sections. One more opportunity to get the bike in there. So many lines. 
I don't think that was the right line. Oh, nope, it wasn't. <laughs> so I'm finding the more I ride out here, when given a line choice, generally if you take the outside line, that's gonna be the way to go. Generally. As I take the inside line. I could probably launch off that. Oh, it's chill. Yeah. Super chill. <laughs> right, I probably would go back up there. Yeah. Getting a little tired. I get it. I'm good. If you live in North County, or well, North County is not too far of a drive for you. Morning. Let's go, one more coming. Then, this is a great place to get your technical riding in, get your climbing in. Overall, pretty fun little trail area. So it's definitely a bit more pedally, but it doesn't have the climbs the whiptail had. So it's got some pedal sections. Catchy. Oh man, that could have been close. Ooh. Front tire bounced off a rock, almost sent me flying. I don't know, it just, I just came like, into it a little too fast, I think. Yeah. I just skidded and then oh. stopped on another one. Oh, yeah. Whew. That's not a place to go over the bar. No, that was, 
Yeah. That got sketchy really quick. And then looking at it, like it's that rock garden is not that bad. Yeah. <laughs> Way easier than all the ones we did on drop down, you know? Never gone this way. All right, we're taking a left and we're gonna finish this trail out. I'm not really sure where this goes. So we'll find out momentarily. Woo. Started to go off trail a little bit. Thanks, man. Have a good one. Cool. All right. And that's going to close us out for the day. Hope you enjoyed this second look at La Costa. You know, download trail forks, bring it out here. Your life will definitely be easier just navigating. And as always, if you want to see more content in the San Diego area, subscribe. I have new videos coming out semi-regularly. And that's it. Thanks for the tail for me today. See you on the next ride.